This small vial contains thorium dioxide, a compound once used in everything from lantern mantles to ceramics and even early camera lenses. Thorium is naturally radioactive. The isotope thorium-232 decays very slowly, with a half-life of over 14 billion years, but it produces a whole chain of radioactive daughters. I'm scanning the sample with my radio code 103, and you can see the radiation levels increase. Most of what we're detecting is gamma radiation from the decay products in the thorium series. In the spectrum, several peaks start to appear. You might see gamma lines from lead-212, bismuth-212, and thallium-208. These are all part of the thorium decay chain. Thorium-232 decays over many steps to stable lead-208. Along the way, it emits alpha particles and gamma rays, which is exactly what we're detecting here. Thorium dioxide is low activity, but still radioactive. And with the right tools, you can see exactly how nature decays, one gamma ray at a time.